What I have here is a set of African musical instruments. They're, uh, they just look like rings, but if they're tuned correctly, they bang them together and it sounds really cute. But I came up with a little routine with them. Uh, the magician rules state you have to count them, so I'll do that. There's one, two, three, four, and five. Now here's the idea. The idea is to take a single ring like this, cross it over there, snap your fingers, and they link. Let's try that again for the people in the cheaper seats. Just take a single ring like that, pull it there, snap your fingers, and now we have, whoops, three rings linked together in a chain, which is very unusual because the other two are not linked together. Uh, that's strange. Usually, you know, when you hit the rings together very hard, nothing happens. But at other times, well, what can you do? Look, one, two, two and a half. <sighs> and that's kind of cute. There's two ways to uh, do what's called a strike link. One is you can hit up here, and the other one is you can hit down there. But a very important thing is to have follow through. So when you strike this, you do that. Well, a strange thing like that happened to me the other evening. I accidentally held this ring next to the other ring like that, and when I let it go, it fell from there to there all the way to the bottom. Another unusual thing, if you take this ring and put it back to the top, it starts from there and goes to the bottom like that. Or you can do another thing. When you rub the ring like this, it jumps up to here like that, and then it jumps up to here like that. And now, I will take this ring and link it to a chain of four in a very open and offhand manner by squeezing there, holding here, grabbing there, and, 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 and there you are, five rings linked together in a chain. Now, before I put them away, I'd like to remind you that I have five steel rings. That's one, two, three, four, and five rings, and that's my solo routine.